We got an update on Baldur's Gate 3 at today's D&D Direct. If you're watching this on uh, April 21st, 2022, it was today, otherwise it was in the past. Anyway, they started off with a funny sketch, as they often do, and then they showed us the progress they've made over the past 18 or so months. And yes, I mean, the, the, the progress, the improvements, the updates to the Early Access version of the game have been uh, incredible. And those of us who have played the Early Access are itching for more. We're itching to get beyond that first chapter. We're itching to explore new areas and encounter new things. But what's already there is a very fun experience if you haven't gone through it yet. Or if you have gone through it a while ago, it might be worth jumping back in and seeing, seeing what's been improved and changed. But we've finally been given a concrete release date of 2023, so uh, it will not be coming out this year, sadly. The full version of the game, that is. The uh, Early Access, of course, is already out, as I've already mentioned. Now, the big caveat, as always, is that, of course, additional delays can happen. And if there are more delays, Larian has uh, a good track record of proving that their delays are well worth it, and that they've done a really good job thus far as far as providing quality updates and really listening to their community. As a rule, I try to avoid hype after the whole debacle with Cyberpunk 2077, but it's really, really difficult with this one. And of course, we are planning to cover it extensively, so of course hit that subscribe button to catch all of our future Baldur's Gate 3 content. Now, the same event also revealed that something else will be coming in 2023. In March, the Dungeons & Dragons movie, Honor Among Thieves, will be coming out, and I'm very curious to see how this does. It's apparently being produced by longtime players of the game, which is good to see. John Francis Daly and Jonathan Goldstein have quite a few writing and production credits under their belts, including a lot of stuff I haven't seen, but they both worked on the screenplay for Spider-Man Homecoming. Anyway, post your reactions to all this in the comments below. We'd love to hear them, and uh, we'd love to hear your thoughts as well. Of course, hit that like button and subscribe, and we will talk to you again very soon. Did you enjoy that video? Let us know by slamming that like button and leaving a comment below. And if you really liked it, consider joining the Triple S Legion by joining our online community, supporting us on Patreon, or checking out the merch store. Subscribe for tons more guides and other fun videos, and for insightful gaming news content, check out our sister channel, Triple S Podcast. Oh,